Hey guys, really quick, let's go over a field test or an at-home test that you can do to assess your overhead range of motion, okay? So I'll demonstrate the movement really quickly. You're gonna be lying on the floor, and this is the most important part, guys, while lying here. Just make sure your back is tight onto the floor. That standardizes our test, okay? Keep your shoulder blades down, so it's just a natural lying position, but I don't want you arching your back. Keep your guts tight, your low back against the floor. Another easy way to do this is just make sure your feet are flat on the floor as well. You're gonna place your hands up above you just like this. So you can imagine just maybe even just touching your thumbs together. And then from here, all you're gonna do is slowly rise your arms over your head, all the way down, and try and place your shoulders, or your, sorry, the, the back of the palm of your hand onto the floor. Now you can see in this test, I'm a little tight, right? The only way for me to get this is gonna to be to widen my hands out, which showcases something is tight in my shoulder complex. Okay, so one more time, thumbs together, slowly overhead. See if you can place your palms down onto the floor. Now the thumbs can come apart here, that's fine. If you can touch the back of your palms with straight arms here with your thumbs touching, that's fantastic. But let them come apart to the shoulder width and down. Now what you're gonna see is I start to flare here. So again, this is showcasing some tension in my overhead position. Now this test does nothing to express where and why or how this is working. So that's something you'll have to work with a coach on or a therapist. But as a general rule, this is a great way just to test your overhead positioning to note if you have to start working on some bottom-up strategies to improve this, okay? And this also might be what's causing some of your problems when you're doing things like kipping pull-ups and overhead positions, if you're feeling some tension around the shoulder, because you may not have the available range of motion to do the exercises properly, safely, and in a performance uh, aspect, okay? So try this at home. If you have problems with it, come talk to a coach, and then we can start to work on ways you can improve this position.